Welcome back to Quadrilateral Cowboy. The clinic job has been completed clinically. No problems whatsoever. It was very simple. The entire thing in just one go. And I guess it's time to celebrate with a shopping trip. So what are we doing now? Shopping expedition. What are we getting this time? You're a new cat. Are you like the previous owner's son or something? And you've inherited the business? I guess so. Satisfaction guaranteed. Choo choos. Yeah, all this is the same still. Alright, blink.exe. But didn't we have that? Actually, let me try this. If I just go to load. And I go to, like, this one. Now, uh, let's go to, uh, this one, I guess. It seemed like I had the blink function. I hope this doesn't, like, cause any problems. I have a backup. If so, it should be fine. Can't I already use the blink function? Oh, God. Ah, that should be fine. Blink... Blink, uh, let's do three commands, I guess, and then do command one as, oh, but we can't, hmm, wait, yeah, I guess I have to do aimbot first, then blink three, and do the command, deploy, turn, 180, fire, I guess just fire. Three blinks? Unassigned. No, I, I guess we just don't have that. Even though, like, I could do it, we're not able to do it just yet. All right, fair enough. So now we finally get to blink. Which kind of like opens up a lot of stuff. This doesn't really change anything about how you do things. It's just another way to do them. Instead of using like the wait command or whatever. Blink.exe. Blink.exe. Guided by wireless physical command macro. Blink. Press Q. Wireless signal. Deck commands. Yeah. Blink. Quick start. Type blink. Blink to. Exit. Aimbot deploy. Oh, I see. So it's not like... I thought it was like blink 3 and then like... The first command was blink 1, the second command was blink 2. But no, it's like... Blink 2 is if you blink 2 times during this mission, you do the entire sequence. Yeah. Exit, aimbot, deploy. Why do you need to do exit? Can you not just do it in aimbot? Just blink to deploy fire, 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 fire. And then just get out. Yeah, you can do that. But then I guess if I do... Sorry, deck, you didn't deserve this. If I then do it here, can I do like blink one, uh, exit, telnet, wait, no, exit, weaver, connect, go, 10, turn, 720, jump. Yeah! Whoa! What? Why did it not do the go 10 or turn? It just like jumped right away. Huh. I'm not entirely sure why... I guess it just doesn't wait for that? You would need wait commands? I wish there was like a wait until the previous command is done command. 
So you didn't have to time it with how long you think it's going to take for it to spin 720 degrees. It, was, it would just be like, don't interrupt previous commands. That would kind of make sense. But yeah, I mean, this, this makes perfect sense. Doesn't sound overly complicated. It's just like a little convenience thing. So yeah, great. Whoa. 0608. Morning carpool. It's kind of a weird uh, time to get up. Whoa. What was that? Wait, what just happened? Did I just change my clothing or something? I can just spin around. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm in my, like... What does that say? Compassion Fatigue. World Tour 1978. Huh. And these are my, like, normal clothes. Can't choose anything else. Let me make a quick save. Yeah, just get in my other gear. So I also have all this stuff. I seem to be living in a better place than my friends. Alright, I've had enough of that alarm clock, at least. Yeah, same pictures here. Adult Night School Poncho, that's my, my name. I've already forgotten what the other two were called. And Poncho seems to be very smart. I mean, I guess all of them are, but... Poncho especially seems to be like the brains behind the operation. One of them was just like... Very... Words... Like book... What, what's the word? Like... She had a lot of knowledge from books. And the other one? What did she do? Kind of nothing? I don't know. Do we get a new, like, airplane minigame or something? What is this? Is that a, like, spaceship? I don't even know what that is. Lego thing? Can't do anything here. Turn on the lights. What? That was already up, though. Oh, I see. It, like, flips them. Huh. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Nice little touch. And up here, more Russian nesting dolls, and compilation of business forms, agreements, and contracts. Picture Atlas, Model K Simulator, Quadratic Engine Architecture. I think we've seen most of these before. Zero Base Division. All of these are like non-fiction. It's all about just like... Hacking and mathematics and science and stuff. Can you break the mirror, I wonder? Oh my god, you can. Seven years of bad luck. Alright, let's go with that. Any mail? There is mail. To Poncho. Someone's knocking. Is that my friend, I guess? Hi, friend. I'll be there in a second. And I can't do anything with this, can I? No. Wish I could open this. That would be fun. Can't steal anyone else's mail. Hey, wake up! 
It's like, what was it? 8 a.m. or 6 a.m.? I can't remember. We can throw everyone's bikes out if I want. What is that? Jalopy chili. Is this an actual recipe? Put everything in slow cooker, cook on low for eight hours. That sounds very simple. I wonder if anyone's made that. I'm sure someone has. If you, like, Google this, there's gonna be someone on, like, Reddit or something that... Or maybe the game's Discord or something that tried out making this. And it was like, oh, that was pretty good. I mean, it all just looks... Yeah, it's, it's a chili. Seems fine. Kinda neat. I like when details like that are in games, like, you know, in Skyrim there's like cookbooks on all the things and whatever. That's that's always fun. And like drinks and stuff. One of my favorite drinks is actually from a video game from uh, Siberia. There's the Blue Helena or Blue Helena. That was like a, a cure-all for the voice of a, an opera singer. And you could like, oh, I can just climb over here? Oh shit, wait, hold on. I gotta load then. Yeah, they're knocking. Yeah, the opera singer lost her voice. Wow, they're actually, it's coded. So it's like, yep, you just climbed over, that's fine. I, I realize that you did that, let's go. Man, this, that's kind of impressive. But anyway, opera singer needed a cocktail and it was like, uh, equal parts honey, uh, vodka, and blue curacao, I think. And then with a squeeze of uh, lime, I want to say, or maybe lemon. I don't even know. But to me, that's like way too sweet and sickly, like too much honey. So I tend to use like less honey, and then I like adding seltzer on top to make it like fizzy. And it's very, a mint leaf or two is also really nice in it. It's like a very refreshing kind of... Almost mojito sort of thing. A little fruity, a little citrusy. It's good. You should try it. Look up the Blue Helena. Though I don't know if there's any information about it anywhere. The Valencia Villa. Thank you. That's quite enough of that. Where are my friends? One is up there. And the other is over here. Alright. Well, leave the simulations to me. Let's save again. Oh, she's like fixing the save point. Is it broken? Can I not save? Is my save going to get corrupted here? Teletran again. Yeah, it's just the same. Valencia Villa. Acquired the loft vault. Timber big. Woodworm. Master... Wiggle? Why does it do that? Bedroom vault. Library vault. Acquired the loft vault. So now it's just like use the blink function or is it just use everything are there alarms and stuff don't really see any cameras there's lasers i guess this literally cannot be opened Was I supposed to go down there? Maybe. Did not really mean to do that. Guess I should read this as well. Vault, laser, wish field, gate, data jack, third floor loft. Blink, number of blinks, command, Press Q, nice ice. Beep. Oh my god, you can like... Oh, I didn't know you could do weight in uh, decimals. Or like fractions, that's that's good. 
Huh. So yeah, you could actually make, like, songs and stuff with blinking. Because it's like... Beep. Neep? Beep. What was it? Zero? No? Is it Intelnet? What did you- how did you beep again? Oh, I see. It's beep zero. Yeah. So, you could do, like, I mean, I could just do it here. Just Wait, if I do it at the same time then, what happens then? Just, like... It's, it's a chord! Wow. That's kind of impressive, actually. Wait. One. Beep. Zero. Beep. Uh. Six. And beep. Four. Then wait. One, beep, zero, always the zero, beep, two, and beep, three. Sick. Didn't really sound very good, but hey, there you go. I don't even know if all of that worked properly. I uh, should probably not waste all this time, though it doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things, but yeah. What the hell is going on there? There's a data jack. Yeah? Flora Carousel. Self-propelled perpetual motion display. Perpetual motion, eh? So they just solved that in this future. Even though it seems kind of shitty and dystopian. Well, it's not even the future, it's the past. It's 1980, somehow. The NADA compliance standards for botanical products except for deviations pursuant to Blossom Notice number 57. Micrographia Magic Corporation. Lasers off for three seconds. Ah! I see. So why don't I just put extraction like here instead? That seems smarter. Oh, I'm doing arrival. Yeah, like that should be fine. Just push that down. And then we need to... Hmm. Yeah, how do you like... How do you do that at the proper time? I guess I can blink? Wait, can I access this? I can't access this, like, the data jack, right? Data hack. No. Data jack? Dear? No objects or anything, no? Because, I mean, I, I guess I can, like, place the weevil on here or something, but... Oh, lantern. Huh. Here, have some light. Flowers. Like, I could have the weevil access it, I suppose. I guess I'm doing that. And then... Weaver. Wait, exit. Weaver, connect. Oh, connect. Oh, that's why... Wait, hmm. How did my uh, blink work before in the testing room? I didn't do connect Nell. Did I? Wait, maybe I did. I can't remember. But yeah, and then I guess I just do data jack. So I, I do blink one, data jack zero? Does it work like that? Yeah. 
And then, like, I'll drop the deck. And then this is open, right? Yeah, that was open. And we save here. Whoa, what are you doing? What the hell was that? And then... We just have to wait until the weevil is all the way up there. Yeah, there you go. Makes sense. So with that... What the hell just happened? It's just, that was just the vault sound. So with that, you can like basically perform commands even through those like no deck zones because you can just set them up in advance. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, woodworm, library vault. Let's check this one out. Now we start here. So what is going on here anyway, like on the bottom floor? Don't shoot me. Laser grid control. Ah. Ah. Do I need to... Wait, is this, like, open? No? Hmm. Three second alarm triggered. Oh, you can only do that for three seconds? Hold on, let me load. So, I mean, obviously, if I break something... Nope, stop. Yeah, the alarm triggers. Makes sense. What's this? $10,000 fine or 500 years jail sentence for tampering or misuse of data jacks. Ah, you open the windows. But it's just these windows. Huh. So, I mean, I, I still can't, like, set up the aimbot. That won't work. Or will it? I guess I could, like, drop in the weevil? Yeah, that, that goes to something. Huh. Let me just explore around a little bit. See what else we're working with here. Yep, here's just the same as before. And that's everything. There was nothing else here? No? How do you even get to the second floor? Like, normally, how would they get to the second floor? Oh, I guess, uh, yeah, the staircase in there. Huh. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure, like, what I'm supposed to try and do here. And this doesn't help, does it? Kitchen... Compartment switch, Chelsea burning title, Valdes, author. Oh, the book, compartment switch. Oh, interesting. Laser grid control. Like, sure, I, I know that, but how do I... Oh, that's weird. How do I do anything here? Yeah, that doesn't really work. Uh. 
Like, I can do that, I guess, but... Does that really help? I'm just turning around a little, seeing what we have to work with. I guess it's over here. Go 50. Turn 30. Turn 20. Go 50. Turn 10. Go 50. Go 30. Oh god. No data, Jax. Yeah, I guess those are just switches, are they? Yeah, they're just light switchers. Face, front. And there was like a book here that was the trigger. But I can't see it. Hmm. Whoa, fancy cupboard. I guess the alarms never reset, huh? All right, well, I don't really know what to do here, but I think I'm gonna have to just leave it off for now and Think about it until next recording session. I mean, there's like ideas, I suppose, but what the? Oh no. Okay, all right. Just don't ever quick save when you're doing anything. Got it. But yeah, there's somehow we need to like hit the, uh, I, maybe I can toss in the auto case through the window and set it up on the floor and then aim it at the button to turn off the lasers or something. But then I have to do like a, Fire, wait three, fire, so it doesn't turn it off for more than three seconds, or else the alarms will will trip, right? So I need to, like, have that set up perfectly, which, I mean, I guess I can do, probably. But we'll see next time. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Bye-bye!